This is a video about atmospheric pressure, wind drive caused by that pressure, and storms on Earth. Our atmosphere is dominated by high and low pressure, and they have distinct effects on the wind. Low pressure always sucks into the vortex, always, and in the north, this flow is counterclockwise when viewed from above. The high pressure always pushes out of the vortex, and in the northern hemisphere, this motion is clockwise. In the southern hemisphere, the lows still suck into the spin, but do so in a clockwise drive, opposite the north, and as you can probably guess, the high pressure still pushes out and does so in a counterclockwise pattern. Now, when it comes to the storms, they stick to the low pressure, not just in the center, but along the convergence lines, where air masses are slamming together from different directions. In the north, the strongest convergence swings south towards the equator, and in the south, these convergences are strongest swinging north towards the equator, both usually on the eastern edge of the pressure cell. This is why it is so easy to take a look at the U.S. wind map and often know exactly where the bad weather will be. This is true all around the world, and always associated with the low pressure systems. The convergence lines combine air of differing temperature, moisture, density, and electric potential. Basic fluid dynamics dictates that an equilibrium must be found. Basic chemistry dictates that this rapid change in characteristics can be accompanied by the release of energy, which we feel on the ground below as bad weather. The observers are investigating the many things our star can teach us about these patterns. The north-south patterns of the Earth have corollaries up there, and the sunspots are remarkably like Earth's low pressure systems. It is likely only a matter of time before people begin to discover and characterize the magnetic connections between the Earth spots, a hypothesis found at suspiciousobservers.org, and which investigates all the connections between earthly and solar storms, including our planet's version of a solar flare.